and welcome back to my channel and welcome to Donald Terrios um, as you can tell he's not at home he's actually out drinking and hopefully he's trying he's hoping to see women hanging around and hopefully he'll get lucky and right now you may be wondering what does Donald Terrio think about Dina marrying Mortimer and at the moment he doesn't want to think about it he knew it was gonna happen because it was in the air he knew that Dina got engaged to Mortimer and he, she, he is trying not to dwell on it because now he understands that Dina is off limits he understands that if Mortimer were to find out about Don and about him, her and Dina, he might die because that guy is a mad scientist, okay? He mad scientists do not play around. Uh, as as far as Cassandra is concerned, um the wedding might still be on. It's just that um we don't know when. No one knows when. So he's trying not to He's trying not to think about Cassandra, Mortimer, Dina, or anyone he knows. He is trying to do what he wanted to do from the very beginning, and that is look for women. Have as many women as possible because, hey, the, there's a lot of fish in the sea. And fish is delicious, so he's going to scope the room to see who is he interested in. Oh, no one? That is interesting that he's trying to be as selective as possible. Scup rip again. No one? Huh. So I guess I'm gonna have to wait until more women appear. Also, I don't think many people are coming. Oh, Marisa Bennett. Al Alison McGaw, Andrea Hogan. There's at least three women that could be interesting. Like he's trying to be picky as possible. Like I understand that no one can be Mina Caliente, but at the same time, come on, Don. So we're gonna greet this Allison. It's gonna appreciate. Hopefully, she'll accept that. No, she didn't like that. Um, what about a joke? How about a joke? Maybe she like a joke? <gasps> Contessa. Oh, she, there's a vampire here. And let's meet Maritza. She looks great. Are you sure you don't even like her like at all? Marissa. Let's tell her a joke. And I don't know, I'm thinking about maybe what if what if Don were to like fall in love with a with a vampire? With a con with a female vampire, that would be so crazy. Okay, what about this Andrea Hogan woman? What person? Who are you talking to? I don't think you. I don't think I can. But let's try again. She looks interesting. She looks fancy. She looks like a. It looks like she has a very nice haircut. Nice to meet you. I'm confused. I don't understand why he doesn't find any of these women attractive. Are there any women coming around? No. Hmm. Let's see. If we can interact with the with the Contessa because that would be super interesting that he hooks up with a with a vampire um talk chat oh uh, so I think she is kind of busy having a meal like he is a little intrigued because wow you look great <laughs> I think oh oh there's another woman we are Florence de la Rosa. Um, Florence de la Rosa. She's from Blue Water Village, but we can talk to her. I I think she's single. 
Hopefully she's single. Like we don't think she's that hot, but um, she's interesting looking. We can talk to the with the with the Contessa Contessa Diane McMillan. Let's talk because because oh my gosh, she looks pretty interesting. She looks really interesting. We can ask her. Um, what is your sign? Oh my god, they're not having a good conversation. What are your... I don't think she's gonna... I don't think she likes us. She is a Pisces. What are your skills? Oh no, she doesn't like that. I think your vampires can recognize that Dawn is not the best person. Cousin, I, I don't think that should be your... I don't think he, that would be his hobby. He should be... Something else. Oh, interesting. Entertain with a joke. Maybe she'll like that. I don't know. Let's see. But the question is, do we even like her? That's the issue. Does she like a scene? Does she like food? No, she does not. She's playing hard to get and that's a little intriguing. Shh, tell a joke, Alice. Hopefully that'll be good. Tell a joke. It's almost four in the morning. And let's see. If check her out just to see. Oh, that's better. No, she does not like her. Hmm. Done. Anyway, let's talk to this Andrea person. Let's entertain her. Let's check her out. I cannot believe this. He doesn't like any of these women. Also, additionally with Cassandra, he's a little confused on why Cassandra accepted so easily. Why did she accept the postpone the wedding thing so easily? But at the same time, he's glad because now he's out and having this relationship with other women. And she liked that. Oh, we don't even like her either. Oh my god. You gotta be kidding me. Where is Marissa? We well, probably have to go somewhere else. Because this is not working. Uh, let's see. Check her out. <laughs> Look at her. What? Oh, he likes her. He does like her. What about Florence? What about Florence? Does she like Florence? Hey. Mm, not one bit, but we're gonna talk to Marisa because we seem to like her the most. So, um, we are gonna ask, what's your sign? What is your sign? <laughs> but she likes us. Hopefully that will work. <laughs> What is your sign? I'm a Gemini. Ooh. She's a two face. I see. Turns you on. She likes blonde hair. What is, she, what is her turn off? She doesn't like logical people. Girl, same. Um, what are your skills? What are your skills? Oh, I'm pretty good. At body, oh, that is intriguing. Good at body. Hmm. Can we charm her? Hopefully, this will, can we charm her? Ah, <gasps> yes. She like, she likes us. She likes us. Um, charm her again. Let's appreciate, admire her. Hopefully, we'll dance together for a bit. Charm her again, hopefully. Um, hello. There we go. Are there any women coming in here? Because we want to meet like a lot of women, and we only seem to like her. I guess the club is very dry at the moment, which is pretty sad. So we have a thirty. We we at least should be friends. So we can like take her later and charm again. 
uh, let's ask uh, about interest because women like to be talk about their interests. Yes. So, um, so joke. She likes that. Oh my god, it's almost time to go. Charm. Charm, charm, charm. Ask about interest. That should be interesting. Let's, then let's know her. She likes to be big city. She likes to travel. And he's like, yeah, I get that. He thinks she's pretty interesting. She likes the weather. She thinks she's fine. Hopefully she's... Oh. <sighs> The game is lagging. Does this mean there's a witch coming? Hopefully. Hopefully there's a witch in here. Witch? Is there a witch? Witch, witch, witch. Is there a witch? Witch. E oh, the evil witch. She has the same name as Kate. Last name as Kaylin. We can... Oh, she's old. But um, let's meet her. They're still sharing about interest, but let's talk to this evil witch because it's fascinating to learn about magic and vampirism. If you might recall, there was a witch, a good witch, in that with Don and Dina's in Dina's Nina's date, and that she seems, although she seems pretty old. I don't know. Let's ask her some questions. What turns you on? What are your skills? We have to. We have. It's time for almost to go. What are your skills? Oh, she doesn't like that. What are your skills, Alice? What are your skills? No, she doesn't like us. She doesn't like us. That is so funny. Maybe we can keep talking to the. To the Oh, I'm pretty sure she needs to go now because it's almost time to to go. So we have her number at least. So it's time to go. We had fun, kind of, because we there the club was really dry today. So I'll see you in the morning, I guess. And good morning, everyone. So um. Don has finally woken up, and although the club was not exercised like at all, because they were like a, it was dry, there were there weren't that many women he was really interested to, but he met. Was her name was Marissa? He met Marissa Bennett, and he hopes to find a connection with her. And by connection, I mean put her in bed. So he's gonna cook something, and after he finish eating, he's going to. He's gonna call her, give her a chat, like just a chat first, because he knows Kaylin's coming over to check on him and check on the house. So it's gonna be just a call. Even though they're, even though Kaylin and Don are in that relationship state that they really don't really don't mind, because it's all casual. Everything about everything about what Don does is casual. Except for Cassandra. So, um, yeah, we met the, con the, the contest that did not like us at all, which is unfortunate. And the atrociously evil witch didn't like us. And we're still going to talk to this Mary Rusher eventually. And uh, Allison, Andrea. But we're here to talk to. Where is she? Maritza. Uh, she's not here. Oh, we can try. That Marisa girl we met at the oldies. Hopefully she'll be someone that we can get to know. Talk because we don't know her that well. So talk a bit. Until it's time to. Is Kaylin coming over? Yes, she is here. Hmm. Oh my, what does me? That is super, she's right here. The moment she came up, she's right there. I guess we didn't have to invite her over. That is so funny. So, um, here's Mary. We 
which we're, we're trying not to do much with Mary in front of Kaylin because we know that Kaylin can be kind of crazy using her blood, you know. So we got talk. Oh, that's interesting. Nika Sang. We barely even know her. That is entertaining with another joke. Um, ask what is your sign. Ask her, um, what are your skills? And ask about interests. She's a Capricorn? No, she doesn't like that. <gasps> she didn't like that. What about interests? She likes magic, I guess. Oh my god, you almost done, Kaylin. We, we need an alone time. She likes the paranormal stuff. Are we okay? Yes, we're okay. So we are tr gonna try to talk to Mary a little bit. Mary, rush her a little bit more. Uh, and not a joke because we want she want we want her to think that we're funny. And we've been like funny man. I he guesses, admire her. Hopefully she will like that. Um and just chat. <gasps> she didn't like that. Wow. <gasps> How in the world? What the heck? That went so down very easily. Um. Huh. So we're gonna we're gonna ask her to leave because what the hell was that? She doesn't like us anymore. What did we do wrong? So goodbye. It was nice. Absolutely, we're in a super bad mood now. I cannot believe this woman doesn't like us. Unbelievable. <sighs> Unbelievable. He's playing the same street. What does she want? She wants to kiss us. She wanted to kiss us, but we're gonna kiss her. A romantic kiss. We want her to make us feel better, you know? How dare a woman not like us? How dare Marisa? We we already hate her. So, Caitlyn saw what happened and he, she's willing to make him feel all kinds of nice. So they're gonna make out and and get him get in bed hopefully she'll say yes to a little no we're gonna no we're gonna we're not gonna use the we are not gonna use the the it's raining we're not gonna use the hot tub which is makes me sad when I want the hot tub it's always it's not on and they already woohoo before, it's just like it was off screen. For because I really want to do something here. He has Bella's picture, which is kind of weird. It's just a quick woohoo because we need a quick woohoo right now. Woohoo. It's just gonna be like, like a tiny quickie. We love quickies. Don likes loves quickies, you know. Oh my god, he's kind of hungry though. Quickie. And you need to eat something now. You need to get your leftovers. You need to eat something now. Yes. Uh, um, Kaylin, what would you eat with us? Like, I know there's not enough um, seeds, but at least eat with me. Eat with me, Kaylin. Oh my god, we're super, super hungry. I don't know if I want to skip work or not. And eat this other... Eat the other one. 
eat the other one eat the other sandwich and clean that up because is someone calling us no the carpet for done is gonna be here soon um we're gonna use our vacation day because hint 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 someone wants to visit us someone wants to visit us and yeah we're gonna be super surprised where is Kaylin? Did she leave already? No, she's still here. We're time to say goodbye to Kaylin. Thank you so much, Kaylin, for making us feel better. We're gonna skip work for this. Come on, say goodbye. And we're gonna ignore that this little section happened. But, um, Dina is gonna suddenly appear in his home. Like, no big deal. So, Dina is going to come over, check on him, you know? Because why not? Hi, nice of you to invite me. Let's, let's pretend that that didn't happen. So, he's gonna use the bathroom. He's gonna watch his... Oh! Hold on, let's just meet her real quick. Kalista Fudge. Let's meet her like super, super real quick before before um, Dina catches us. She seems very nice to me. What does she want? Tough handshake. Ooh. So we're gonna say goodbye to her. Oh. Hmm. Do we like her? Do we like her? Oh. We like her how much? We like her enough. Interesting. She wants to ask Kalista on a date? Wow. So let's say goodbye real quick before Dina notice something. Oh, she noticed. No, don't go to work. Don't go to work. And Dina is a little bit like... Um, what the hell is going on here? Oh, yeah, we need to invite her over. Let's kiss kiss darling because Dina is now a god and she loves to do that. Oh, Don, how are you? Mwah, mwah. Hi, Dina. And what does she want for us? Listen to her. No? She is still very mad about them. About the burglar, but she's gonna go to the bathroom real quick. Dina, come on in. Let's pretend that Don just came from work and that's why he's dressed like that <laughs> that's funny but at the same time what is dina doing here shouldn't she be at a dance no 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 at mortimer's household it's gonna be like um dina nice to see you but what are you doing here what are you doing here D and dina is like oh just catching up with my old friend don and Don is like, yeah, friends, right? And he doesn't believe her one bit. He's gonna answer the phone and trying to ease up the tension that's coming out of him, out of this. Who's calling us? Oh, isn't she Lisa Koo? We met her at the club, but she was just a pretender, kind of. Let's hang up. We don't. We're not interested in her. But he's gonna keep questioning Dina. Dina, 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 Dina. Dina, 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 Dina. Where is the talk? Here you go. Dina, what's going on? You know, what's going on? Because I, because you're married to Mortimer now. And she's saying, I know, I'm a god. I'm just here to have a discussion with you. And then it's like, what kind of discussion? And he's, she's saying like, I, I, been seeing what you do, been seeing what you do as, as for a living, and I think I'm interested in doing the, in the medical career. And he's like, Oh really? I, I never thought you'd be interested in medicine. And read deep down, she's doing it because she wants to see Don more frequently. Because that's the way. That's a way for her to like 
keep an eye on on him and 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 like that yeah he just can he, she cannot stay away from him like at all which is very very unfortunate because Dina you are married and and Don is trying to like not be freaked out about the possibility that Dina might be stuck not stalking him but like be super obsessed on him but um she's gonna caress her a bit like uh like oh my god you look beautiful but at the same time he's trying to get away he's trying not to do much with her because if if more and more were to find out about if if more and more were to find out that Dina is right here he he's gonna die Mortimer does not play so um Dina's gonna kiss him out of a sudden and Don is like oh okay okay and Don is gonna be like listen we we cannot do this and Dina loves the son of that she loves the son of that like oh we cannot keep seeing each other oh secrecy we are so taboo and he, and she he can tell that he's she's not gaining it, so he's gonna keep talking to her like, um, listen, Dina. Um, I'm marrying Cassandra. You do know that I'm marrying Cassandra, right? And Dina's like, oh, but day was canceled. No, it's not canceled. It was just postponed. Postponed, canceled, whatever. Like, whatever the case, I still enjoy your company, Don. Um, Dina, listen to me. You are now Cassandra's stepmother. Okay? And sooner or later, I'm gonna marry Cassandra. And you're gonna be my... Now you're gonna be like my mother-in-law. I don't even... Like, this is so twisted. I, I don't think we can keep doing this. And Dina's like, oh my god, you cannot be serious, Don. You're the one who came to me. Who came to me? We are known each other since we we are known each other forever. Like, what are you seeing, Cassandra? Anyway, and Don is like, um, and he's got he's actually thinking about it. Like, what do you even see? <laughs> Hold on, what? What do you even see in Cassandra? And right now he's thinking about it. Like, what do I see, in Cassandra? And to be fair, Cassandra is a lot like Bella. And he can. T it reminds her a lot of her. And Cassandra is charismatic, beautiful, smart, strong. She has beautiful eyes. And th that was the wrong thing to ask because now he's thinking about Cassandra. And Dina notices this for a bit. Like, like you actually, you actually love her. What do you even care? You're married to Mortimer. You shouldn't even be, be here anyway. Why are you here? And Dina's like, um, does it matter? And Don is like, um, I don't mess with married women. I I have values. And Dina's like, oh, hold on. Was I not married to Michael when I cheated with you? And you're the one who's cheating on Cassandra with me. So I don't understand why you're playing the Hoyer and Talk card. Who do you think you are? You cannot judge me. Take a look in the mirror. Take a look in the mirror. We are just the same. We That's why we understand each other so much. We're not that different. At least I didn't marry for money. And Dina's like, oh, I cannot believe you. Like, how dare you implied I'm a gold digger like like what makes you think that you're not doing this to get into the God family we are the same okay we are the exact same and you cannot judge me like this like I cannot like I just wanted to I just wanted to have a little fun with you but now you I'm not even in the mood right now I'm not in the mood thank you so much Don I cannot even visit a friend without being judged Everyone keeps judging me, and you, are, you're not supposed to be the one to judge me. So, but, but so, and Dana's like, just goodbye, goodbye, Dina. Go to Mortimer. I don't want to get in trouble. He can kill me, and Dina's like, he can kill you. He's an old man. 
He's no, you gotta take a shower, and I guess I'm gonna end this part right here. I think I did enough. So, um, yeah, we find out a few interesting things about Don today. We find out that he is kind of afraid of Mortimer. He is now trying to play this holy and stuff on Dina, and Dina does not appreciate that. She now she's really mad at Don because how dare you play on my gold here? We also learn how much of a hypocrite Donatello can be. He's trying to play this card that, oh, I don't mess with married women. And Dina did not appreciate that, that, like, I mean, yes, she shouldn't be here because she is married to Mortimer. But at the same time, he shouldn't be, he shouldn't be such a liar about this stuff because he did mess with Dina when he, when she was married to Michael. And, um... He's trying to pretend that he has values, that he's above being a homebreaker, but she's right. They are not that freaking different. He really should take a look then, in the mirror. What do you think is going to happen? Do you think Do you think the wedding is actually going to continue to be a thing? What do you think of Marisa? Do you think she's actually like a good um, a good good enough for him? Even though she's all even though he knows that it's only for a few nights and that's it because he he doesn't like her that much and he's a little interested in Callista too he likes Callista so much he wants to go on a date with her I think it might be where he wants to get a public woohoo and he still wants to woohoo with Nina in a car so Nina has not stayed out stay away from his thoughts he he feels something for, for Dina that he doesn't feel for Cassandra, but at the same time, he's thinking about it like, maybe I do love Cassandra, maybe I should marry her. I need to do think, the, thing, the right thing. And he just hopes that Cassandra can accept that, that he can forgive him, even though he, she seemed very forgiven. And he she, she accepted the whole postponing postpone the wedding at the same time, he wants to make things right just for the sake of keeping up appearances because sooner or later, everyone's gonna find out that he's not the greatest person alive. So he's gonna go to bed and I'm finally gonna end things right here. Think ending things right here, leave a comment, um, like or dislike this video and subscribe because that's the most important thing to me. And um, thank you so much for watching my videos and hopefully it'll be a very long series because Bless and Beauty is a super entertaining, super entertaining town to do and I hope to make it as long as possible and hopefully entertain every, every single one of you who are sticking up with me and I'll see you on my next episode of my Bless and Beauty series. Bye bye!